Gotta dress like one. Your look goes with the way you sound. Almost always, with like, without even thinking about it. Looks aren't important, but style is important. Of course, you gotta have your own style. You gotta be unique. Why would you want to be like everyone else? Why would you want to you wanna almost stand out? You want people to notice you? I feel like a total rock star. I think style is really who you are. It's, it's sort of an extension of your soul and who you really want to be. If you have that it factor, that it quality, then your image will be the image that becomes a phenomenon. Coming up with a look is definitely difficult or definitely not difficult depending on who you are and what you want to look like. Definitely try to find your own, find the people that you love and try to, you know, pull from them. Really pay attention, you know, look at magazines that you wouldn't typically look at. Know what the latest trends are. Don't necessarily follow them, but have an idea so you don't look outdated. Find your own look. Do something original, do something that comes from you, from your heart. Wear crazy stuff. Wear stuff that people are afraid to wear out on the streets because that's what catches people's eye. You don't have to be scared to wear, I'm wearing like striped pants today. Like, Just wear whatever you like, who cares what anybody thinks and people will like it because you can carry it off. If, you, if it's something that you really like, you'll be able to pull it off and it's more about being you and not trying to dress how people want you to dress. You have to be true to yourself. And being true to yourself is the key with everything. But I don't necessarily think that it has to be extra for no reason. It has to be extra to make sense to people. Everybody that occupies that spotlight has to have the utter comfort of who they really are. And that somehow that style is embodied by their dress, their manner, their physicality. I think people could basically wear anything or, or, or have any kind of look if they're comfortable and say, wow, you know, this is me, this is my look. If you feel comfortable in it, then wear it. I found my style, I'm not saying I'm a rock star, but <laughs> I found my style. I know it fits me and I learned to work with it. I like shiny stuff, black and shiny and black and white, stuff like that. And I just, I wear it, you know, wear it with confidence and presence. If you want to go all out and have the funky little hairdos and all out makeup and crazy clothing, that's you. That describes you as a person. We are really into like the skinny jeans, like the tight jeans. Those are like the new thing, I guess. And uh, there's definitely a rock star look. Like for me, I prefer tight jeans and I prefer tight shirts and stuff like that. And you know, the sweetest new pair of shoes that just come out. Always keep your shoes clean. You gotta keep them clean. Because if they're not clean, it makes you look a little dusty, you know what I mean? Your, your whole outfit could be, you know, kind of shaggy. But if your shoes are clean, you're a nice, crisp guy, you know what I mean? The Jonas Brothers have a great rock style hair. Their hair is just so cool and so ch ch and so it's, it's rock star hair. <laughs> Go to a sweet hair salon, get your hair cut, ask them for something crazy and usually they'll give you something cool. You have to have the image to be a rock star. You have to look like a rock star. You have to carry yourself like a rock star. And like my man, my man Baron over here said, you gotta have your shades on. Because when you have your shades on, you know, it, it kind of makes you invisible, you know? You're just sitting there, you're looking at me. Looking at me. <laughs> you're just being real cool with your shades on. You gotta rock your sunglasses. Like, I have a white pair of sunglasses that I wear constantly. And um, I just, I'm kind of addicted to wearing them, you know? I know the Jonas Brothers are always in their shades, and they're always like, try these on, try these on. There's so many amazing sunglasses out there. There are vintage glasses that are just great, and everyone's like, where'd you get those? And they're one of a kind because they're vintage. I think aviators are really cool. Then if you like bling them out, you know what I mean? I just said bling, but <laughs> if, you, uh, if you do, if you bling them out, they make them look super cool. And they give you a little bit of mystery, you know? You just kind of, if you can't see someone's eyes, you just don't always know what they're thinking. It just makes them, I don't know, a little bit more interesting, I think. Lonely. I'm so lonely, I have nobody, I'm not alone. Woo! Glasses just make you look like you're somebody. So if you want to be known or uh, be portrayed as somebody, please get yourself a pair. When you walk in the room with a good pair of shades, people are like, who is that? And you're like, it's just me. But still, you know what I mean? I think it, um, if you got the right pair of shades on, I don't know, it just, it works, you know? It's just instant cool. That simple. 
the way to roll. Two rules in fashion. Do not wear sunglasses that you can't pull off and never wear heels that you can't walk in. If you can't walk in your heels, it's a dead giveaway. You're not a true rock star. Yo, let's dance battle. Yeah, right now. Let's go. If you really want to rock out,